<laughs> Lunch with Johnny Barneycorn. Yeah. We're on our way. On our way to lunch. Yeah. At our diner. With the dogs. Not with the dogs. We're not you taking can, the dogs. You should die. Die. Yeah, that's the way we look at it. <laughs> you better have deep roots in the aquifer because uh, I'm not going to water you. <laughs> I do a little bit of watering, but. I've lost quite a bit. This has been a really hot summer. And it's yep. not done yet. No. Oh well. It's not going to be over probably till September or October. Don't usually see me on this side of the truck. No. This is John's truck. Tom riding. It's yeah. Nice to ride. Yeah, it is. There's our diner that we like to go to. And the reason we like this diner is because John and I have something in common. Yeah. We're both cheap. We're cheap and we like to eat. Yeah, we're cheap and we like to eat. There's two things. Yeah. Really we're going to run over to a uh, pipe store. Look around a little bit while we're out and about. It's one I complained about in the past. Back Give that a place I didn't care for. Yeah. I talked Tom into it. Talked me into it. But I came here yesterday anyway to buy something. So I'll tell you something, guys. We actually just had a really positive experience at the uh, Cigar and Company House of Fine Smoke here in Oklahoma City. Yep. And they have a, a great selection of pipes. Um, Tobacco. So I guess the day I came in here and got kind of treated rudely, maybe the guy was just having a bad day. But they got great pipes, great tobacco. Uh, I bought some of their cherry blend and um, an ounce of their Dunhill, one of their Dunhill blends, and I'm going to give that a try. But you know, I'm in search of a perfect cherry, so I thought I'd take a chance. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me rephrase that. <laughs> That's a box opening. And this comes from Pennsylvania. And I'm pretty excited because it's my very first Boswell pipe. Probably won't be my last, but I'm pretty excited about it. Housekeeping. Peterson, KMP, um, Fishtail, with um, oh, John was over earlier today. He gave me a little baggie of uh, some of those uh, bullseye flakes, and he had dropped it in uh, a bag that was full of uh, Virginia. So I just grabbed the flake and a little bit of that Virginia and mixed it together and stuck it in there and it's a pretty good smoke. But anyway, let's see what's inside of here. Tack it from this angle. Tobaccos. I just ordered two ounces to figure out which one of these I liked, and I keep hearing about all of them. So I'm going to try them all. Two ounces of Berry Cobbler, PA Dutch Street, Apple Strudel, and uh, some Christmas cookies. I'm pretty excited about all that. And, uh, because I'm ever in search of the uh, perfect cherry tobacco, uh, got some cherry smash, so that'll be interesting. Now, alright, got it all. And now for the pipe. Let us take a look at the pipe. There's 
together before I show it to you. Oh well. <laughs> oh, I love it. It's uh, it's going to be one of my bigger pipes. It's a Rhodesian little eight bend. I'll, I'll try to videotape it up close, but this camera doesn't do much good anyway. The grain is very nice. I like the decorative detail around the top. It's smooth. The stem, which I'm sure you can't see, has got a real cool kind of uh, milky pattern throughout it. Got a nice bowl. Not huge. But uh, gonna be, it'll be nice long smoke, good enough. Beautiful pipe. Beautiful pipe. Seems to have a nice draw. So, uh, great. I'm excited about this. My first Boswell pipe. A nice bag came with it. Lots of backy and something to smoke it in. And of course some pipe flingers and matches and stuff. So that's pretty exciting. Anyway, I uh, was looking on their website. And of course anybody who's gone to their website knows that there's pipes. Uh, they uh, disappear pretty quick. But interesting, interestingly enough, the one pipe that I liked the most out of all of them they were showing wasn't sold. So uh, either it was meant to be or I had such poor taste that I bought the pipe nobody else wanted. But anyway, I think it's a beautiful pipe. And uh, maybe at the end I'll try to videotape it. But I'm loaded now, loaded for bear. Got uh, plenty of tobacco and a new tobacco burning instrument. So I'm pretty excited about that. Anyway, take care guys. Bye. Like I said, this camera doesn't do that great up close. But, uh, we'll try.